Hello guys, today I'd like to tell you valuable information about the cherry tree and how it can be used. The cherry tree is a medium sized tree up to a height of 25 meters. The leaves of the cherry tree are elliptical to ovate. They are sawn at the edge and alternately arranged. In autumn the leaves turn yellow and fall off towards winter. The bark is reddish brown and separates into horizontal narrow stripes. As the bark is slightly cracked, the weather side of the trunk likes to moss. The bark can be used to reach very high temperatures with a fire. The bark is often used as tinder too. All cherry species release a rubber as wound closure in case of injury. This isn't cherry resin, but rubber. Rubber dissolves in water and does not burn in contrast to resin of conifers. The cherry rubber is used for sore throats. You can simply suck it without preparation. The cherry is pollinated by insects. It blooms strikingly in April and May, when the tree is covered with small, white, slightly fragrant flowers. By far the best thing about the tree, however, is the fruit, which shines red in summer. The cherries are stone fruits, they have a hard core, which should not be eaten. If you swallow one by mistake, it isn't so bad, if it wasn't bitten before, because broken cherry stones are poisonous. The taste of the cherries is very sweet and delicious. The riper the cherries, the sweeter. The flesh of the cherries also become redder as they ripen. The cherries are usually eaten raw cooked into jams or used for cakes. But also the wood of the cherry is used. It is relatively dense and easy to bend. Due to this property it is easy to work with. However, cherry wood is not weather resistant, so it is not used outdoors. In the interior, however, cherry wood furniture is often found, as it has a beautiful intense grain and a reddish brown color in addition to the structure suitable for processing. Alright, that's it. I hope you enjoyed. Bye.